Hey guys, welcome back to All in Law. In this video, I'm going to talk about cyclic neutropenia. Okay, so I'm going to talk briefly about this cyclic neutropenia. It's really very important. Okay, and it's remember it's a very rare disorder. Okay, so in this condition, the cyclic neutropenia name itself indicates there is a cyclic neutropenia means every 14 to 36 days, 14 to 36 days of interval, you find from normal what you call neutrophil count to low or a neutropenic levels. Right, so 14 to 20 days, 36 days, sorry. 14 to 36 days interval, right? And in this condition of a cyclic neutropenia, the patient can have uh, what you call cyclic patterns in what you call reticulocytes, platelets, and even leukocytes. Means RBCs, you can call it as WBCs. Neutrophil is also one of the WBC, right? And even the platelets, right? Okay, and the characteristics of this cyclic neutropenia, the neutropenic phase, what we call, is the patient will have, uh, when the levels of neutro neutrophils go down, they will have oral ulceration. Stomatitis. Okay, lymphadenopathy, lymphadenopathy, and even some severe infections like pneumonia and mastoiditis. The patient can present with these symptoms. So try to memorize this. This is really very important for USMLE. Pneumonia. And then we have mastoiditis. Right? So, this cyclic neutropenia is believed to be result from a regulatory abnorm, what you call abnormalities of hemopoiesis. abnormalities of hemopoiesis. So it's a kind of recombinant human GCSF recombinant human GCSF GCSF is useful to treat severe neutropenic phases right so treatment you can do this but if this fails then you have to go ahead with uh, a bone marrow transplantation bone marrow transplantation right guys so remember about this patient that these patients if 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 you take the if you check the WBC count during the interval phase where you find the normal levels of uh, what you call um, the leukocytes, the neutrophils will be normal. But during the neutropenic phase, if you take out and if you, if you see, then there will be a neutropenia. That's why it's known as a cyclic neutropenia, right? And um, if you examine the bone marrow during this neutropenic phase, okay, it shows either hyperplasia or arrest of maturation at the melocyte stage. Right, so this is regarding the brief information about the cyclic neutropenia. Thank you so much for watching this video. Take care.